The chaotic road to SummerSlam is all right to this. One of the most anticipated matches in WWE history for the WWE Championship. But it's more than that. It's a match between a superstar who left WWE to find himself and came back to win a championship and a living legend looking to cement him. Probably not going to win for a couple hundred years, Byron. You know why? I'm playing a rigorous stretch. I have no idea. Oh, what a great escape. Champ now absorbing a little damage. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. And he counters with a headlock backbreaker. Vintage Randy Orton. Orton's clearly in control now. It looks like he's trying for a top rope hung DDT. His opponent's doing everything he can to counter. And here comes Shawn Michaels with the assist. But Shawn gets taken out. And now the challenger has an opening. Orton charges. Drop to hold him to the corner. Meanwhile, broken loose at ringside. It looks like they'll no longer be a factor in this match. This is now truly one-on-one. -on -one. Or is it? Slade is here. What happened to the gentleman's agreement? It's out the window, clearly. The challenger's in big trouble here. Okay, oh, Randy Orton! What the hell? Did that just happen? Apparently Slade hasn't gotten over being replaced. And that could be enough to end this. Orton kicks out. I thought that was it. So did the challenger, but it's going to take a lot more than that to put away the Viper. Getting carried. I'm sure what they're thinking. Oh man, taking it to the trachea. Taking this outside. This could be good. Oh, slingshot. <laughs> That is tossing your own body around without a care. Taking no account for your own well-being. Stone Cold Stone! It's over! Some hard offense landing on the champ. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. It works. Uh-oh. High risk cross body. That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Oh, great. Rearranging our ringside furniture here. Here are the announce desk. What a mess. Battling ringside and our announce table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. I get nervous when the fight comes out here, guys. Everyone needs to get out of the way of this fight. This he has got something destructive in his mind. <laughs> These superstars are just wreaking havoc. Our announce table has been reduced to scraps. This is less like a match and more like me. Nice oh, setting him up. Oh, no. This is, this is going to be bad. Display of power. This announce area has been decimated. It looks like a hurricane came through here. The table, the monitors, all destroyed. Ooh, brutal body shot. Set up in the corner of the ring. Close line in the corner with a championship on the line. And the count does 
victory parade. Viper in full control. Fall away slam. Shot of Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's gonna hurt. Cranking the head. Oh man, Orton just stomping away and enjoying every moment of it. Won't give up for the championship. He did it. Not only is he the new WWE champion, but he beat the dead ride and is officially here to stay. Not to interrupt the victory celebration, but Shawn Michaels is back. Maybe to do that exact thing. It's over. You lost. Just give the man his due for once. to be a small sign of respect for Michaels to the new champ. Maybe they can finally put all this behind them and move on. Much of the criticism he faced earlier in his career centered around his inability to work with others. So it was fitting that tonight it came down to just him and Orton in the ring. One on one. No one else to rely on but himself. What the heck? That's Sami Zayn! The new champion was just blindsided with the Money in the Bank briefcase. Is Sami cashing in? He is! It's official! We have a second impromptu WWE Championship match at SummerSlam! I can't believe this is happening! He beat the deadline, but he might not walk out of here champion! Buckle up, everybody, because we might be witnessing one of the most electrifying cash-ins in WWE history at one of the craziest SummerSlams of all time. Sami Zayn has shocked not only the brand new WWE Champion, but he's shaken the WWE Universe to its core. Myself included. Could somebody please pick my job off the floor so I can call this match? You're on your own, Corey. It's Sami Zayn versus the newly minted WWE Champion for the title right now. Sami Zayn retaliates. Going counter for counter. Now, can it be capitalized on? He's one step ahead there. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Ouch. Whip, but Sammy reverses. Oh, the newly minted champion hit hard. And Sammy Zayn looks to capitalize. He's setting up for the Haluva kick. This could be it. He moved. <laughs> he dodged the Haluva kick. With the roll up. And it will do it. He successfully defended his WWE championship after Sammy Zayn's shocking cash in. Sammy Zayn can't believe it. He thought he picked the perfect moment to cash in. And there goes Sammy. Thanks for coming out. And now the champion's faction has come out to congratulate their leader. We talked about how the champion wanted to do everything himself when he first got to WWE, but he wouldn't be experiencing any of this if he hadn't learned to be part of a team and eventually lead one. Some of these men may now be looking for an opportunity to face the new champion. But for tonight at least, it's time to soak this all in and enjoy the moment. And there you see Slade who had his share of ups and downs with the new champion after being dropped from the title match tonight, but still making his presence known. He may also be looking for redemption. But for now, it seems as if he's willing to give his former ally the respect he deserves. Good, because I don't think we or our champion can withstand another impromptu match. Let the man celebrate. He's earned it. He certainly has, Corey. Thank you once again for joining us at SummerSlam. Good night, everybody.
Was he stubborn? Definitely. Like right up there with the best of them, including yours truly. And things definitely didn't go as planned. I mean, I haven't been in management for too long, but even I know it's not the intention to fire a top prospect and then go to war with them after they forced their way back into WWE. But at the end of the day, we trusted the process and the results speak for themselves. He lived up to his potential, didn't he? We said he was a future champion, and now he is. We weren't wrong. Did he color outside the lines a bit on his way there? Yes. But that's what the best artists do, and I respect that. I really do. Uh, sorry, but I wasn't actually recording yet. Do you mind saying all of that again? <laughs>